Hi there. Applicants to bachelor's programs in the US typically tend to get confused between the Bachelor of Arts and the Bachelor in Science, right? So, uh, and this situation is especially true if you're applying for a program in computer science. Students often get confused what exactly is the difference between a BA and a BS? How are they exactly different? And, and does it really matter? You know, the differences, are they stark enough to affect my decision? So how should I decide which approach is more suited to me? In this video, I'm going to discuss the difference between the Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Science when it comes to computer science uh, programs in the US. My name is Anand Venkatesh and I'm the founder and mentor of this platform called MentorsCapital.com. Backed by a vast network of mentors, we give you this information that is quite relevant to your admission journey. Alright, now the thing that I'm going to cover in this video is the exact nature of the Bachelor of Art program in Computer Science and how does that compare with the Bachelor of Science program. Uh, let's start with the BA or the Bachelor of Arts in Computer Science. Uh, now, a Bachelor of Arts program in CS is typically one that gives you a broad understanding within the field of computer science. It will give you all the basic information you need to understand the field. Uh, the, in the, in the course structure itself will be quite comprehensive, which means that besides teaching you the basics in the field of computer science, it will also give you uh, the option to choose plenty of electives from other disciplines, other departments as well. Right Now, this is what the Bachelor of Arts is. Why should you choose a Bachelor of Arts program? Well, uh, in terms of a career plan, choose a BA in computer science if you're sure about computer science as you know a field that you want to study. However, you're not exactly sure about what you will do in this field, exactly the kind of role or specialization that you would like to pursue in the particular field. And hence, if you're not sure about an exact career path, then a Bachelor of Arts is probably something you should choose. The reason I say that is that the program structure of a BA is that it does include the basic course, uh, you know, basic courses on computer science, but it also includes plenty of courses on humanities, social sciences, areas that you can actually, you know, explore in your undergraduate program, right? Now, as a student, uh, if you're looking to, uh, you know, study a flexible program, one that allows you to choose, you know, not just, you know, the basic area, the major area of your study being computer science, if it also allows you to choose other minors, it allows you to choose a double major, uh, then chances are that a BA is probably a better choice for you. Now, second, uh, at the other end is the Bachelor of Science program, right? Now, a BS in computer science is actually a very, very specialized course, right? A typical BS program will be quite technical. You know, it will involve a lot of core, uh, you know, subjects which pertain to computer science, which pertain to advanced mathematics. Uh, and uh, as compared to a Bachelor of Arts program, the Bachelor of Science program will have a lot more required courses, right? It will have a very, very strict curriculum and, and you will have, you know, greater need to study technical fields or technical courses of study. So who should exactly choose the Bachelor of Science program in computer science? Well, if you're somebody who are very, very sure about what you want to do in the field of computer science, the exact area of specialization, whether it's, you know, artificial intelligence, whether it's machine learning, whether it's uh, systems design, uh, well, then the Bachelor of Science program is more suited to you. The reason is that the program structure of a typical BS uh, offered by universities in the US will be that it's very, very strict in terms of curriculum. Uh, a lot more required courses are included uh, from the field of computer science. Uh, it will include a lot of advanced math courses. So if you're uh, you know, inclined towards math, that's also a plus for choosing the Bachelor of Science program. Remember, it's a course that builds you to a uh, towards a very, very specific uh, career in the field of computer science and information technology. Well, all of this information uh, uh, we've been able to compile only because we bank on our vast network of mentors. Uh, you know, these are people who've gone, gone through the exact same journey as you probably are on. And their 
experiences, the wealth of knowledge that they bring to the table could really make the difference between you, you know, just applying to a bunch of universities and actually getting through your dream university, right? Uh, this expertise can span the entire journey, starting from shortlisting schools, uh, preparing for standardized tests, uh, preparing a actual application, the essays, the SOPs, the letters of recommendations, and finally, tackling admission interviews or other online assessments that universities typically require. Uh, my name is Anand Venkateshan. I hope you liked this video. Do give me a thumbs up if you did. Uh, the comments, uh, you know, on the, uh, to this video can help me, you know, ascertain if you have any specific queries, if you'd like me to cover specific topics. Uh, link in the description can uh, help you reach out to us directly. If you have any queries, if you'd like to consult a mentor from our, from our last network, do give us a shout. Thank you. Have a great day and wish you all the very best.